I mean, look, I've got only great things to say about this. This is only a first impressions video. All right, so this is the place I was telling you about. Check it out, it's called Latin Diner. Right, let's give this a try. Look at that. Hopefully you enjoyed that amazing, amazing Cuban breakfast. Latin Diner, make sure you go check them out. The bike feels incredibly, incredibly planted, and that's an important point. My goodness, complete comfort, complete wind coverage. You know, just super plush suspension. Because I'm gonna give you my first impressions of that BMW RT. All right, everybody, welcome back to the channel. Fly and ride here. Absolutely beautiful morning, Saturday morning, 37 degrees, and I am taking you off for another fly and ride. Awesome video, and I got a great one for you today. We're heading out to uh, meet the crew, different rest stop that we normally go to, because Mr. Nadal Sr. has bought himself a brand new motorcycle and as you probably saw from the thumbnail it is the awesome 2024 bmw 1250 rt and uh we're headed down i'm gonna get a chance to see the bike for the first time we got steve coming down with the other bmw gs so today it's gonna be a bmw kind of day if you like these kind of bikes stick around because I'm going to give you my first impressions of that BMW RT and uh, we're going to take it for a spin. If you're new here, I'm Flying Ride and on this channel I focus on motor vlogs, ride videos, ride reviews all on my 2022 BMW R1250GS and on my 2020 Streetlight CVO and we do everything here on the channel including testing out new bikes, bringing all sorts of different bikes to the channel destination rides group rides cinematic drone footage all here on the channel so do me a favor if you're new hit that subscribe button hit that like button hit that bell notification so you can be reminded of future content making sure the gopro's on if you use a gopro <laughs> you know what happens it works what it wants to so i've got my heated gear settings on too i've got the seat on too nice and toasty so uh, we're meeting at the uh, Mammoth uh, rest area. finally uh, decided to get himself this uh, BMW uh, 1250 RT it's an absolutely beautiful bike and uh, I'll talk about the bike a bit more when I get there I'm gonna show you a full walk around of the bikes and uh, and then from there I'm gonna take it for a quick spin just to give you my first impressions now if you know anything about these bikes uh, the both his bike and my bike they share the same engine which is the boxer engine, the 1250. But of course, his bike, it's got a fairing, it's got a uh, different seat, it's a completely different design. Different uh, tire size in the front. I mean, it's a completely different ride, and uh, Nadal says it is just absolutely smooth, super nimble, which of course is typically the way that I describe this bike. But uh, as you know, this is uh, considered technically an ADV bike. And, uh, you know, I have taken it off-road a few times. I've also busted my rear end off-road on it. So 
so I'll admit I'm a bit uh, gun shy to get back out there and uh, I am going to consider taking the BMW off-road school here in the future and then uh, definitely take this bike out on the BDR so you, again you're going to want to stick around but for now man I've got these Michelin on this uh, bike it just it's a sport bike it just hauls and you saw it back there man it just it just gets up and boogies so senior should be here uh, we'll be here in about five minutes still got some nice colors down here with the foliage and then uh, we're gonna go test out that bike and uh, take it through uh, some of uh, New Jersey backcountry roads and of course I'm the first one here let's put this bad boy right here let's connect this bad boy here all right, we're gonna wait for Senior to get here. Steve's uh, 25 minutes away. And then uh, I'm gonna show you the bikes when we get here and then we're gonna go uh, for a spin. Stay tuned. There it is, Mr. Senior, congrats, man. As always, he's so gracious, he's gonna let me take it for a spin. We're not gonna go crazy on it, he's still breaking it in, but uh, I am gonna give you my first impression. Right, right. But uh, just look at this thing, man. It is just, the curves on this thing are just stunning. Let me just give you a nice walk around of this bike real quick. It's just absolutely beautiful. It's got uh, upgraded package. Those rims uh, is an upgraded package that comes with this particular model. Again, this is the uh, 2024 1250 RT. Same engine, same shaft as my bike, but obviously completely, completely different. We're going to turn it on here in a minute. Look how nice it is from the front. Beautiful, beautiful bike. All right, let's take this thing for a spin. Wow, look at this. This is uh, for the windshield right here, right? Okay. You, is this... Is this the down position or the up? Man, this thing just feels awesome. Wow. <laughs> look at that display. Just look at that thing. All right, let's start her up. Oh, sounds good. He just ordered the Akrapovich exhaust for it. This he already changed. It's a bigger windshield, I think. It's got a nice tinted. Uh... Look at that. Wow. This thing just covers the whole thing. Holy smokes. Look at that. There's no wind that's going to get through there. All right, we're going to put it in the down position for now. It's got 92 miles on it. I'm not used to this machine, bro. All right, here we go. 2024 BMW 1250 RT. First impressions here on the Fry Ride channel. Wow, it just feels very nimble. I can tell you that already. All right, so here's my first impression. And again, I'm going to give you this. Uh, so my lens obviously is coming uh, from a GS, but also a Harley. So I'm going to try to give you both uh, comparisons here and these first impressions. The first impression I'm going to give you right now, the leg position is very different than on the GS. The leg position here, your knees are much higher. Uh, you, you, you feel like you're much more in the tucked position. Man, that is smooth. And again, he's still breaking it in, so we're not going to go uh, faster than this, but wow, that is nimble. Look at this. So uh, my second impression here that I'm going to give you is um, how, how nimble it feels. Let me put it on fifth gear here. Let's put this windshield up real quick. Wow, man, this thing just come like there is zero wind hitting you right now. The throttle is look at this is I'm at 4,000 RPM and this thing is already uh, it's already moving. 
so obviously this windshield is freaking amazing you can go up and down I'm gonna bring it back down all the way here and uh, I can see right over it which is perfect the bike feels incredibly incredibly planted and that's an important point uh, I test rode a GT version of these BMW bikes and uh, I did not like it because the bike did not feel planted but this thing man it just feels awesome and look at this I mean literally you just I mean all you got to do is just touch this put some pressure on it and this thing is already moving this got this bike has to feel absolutely amazing on the twisties no doubt about it the seat is very very comfortable the riding position is very comfortable this display is freaking amazing looks like you got an old uh, Harley up there it's kind of cool oh that's not only a Harley that's a police officer <laughs> hey officer how you doing wow that's awesome Jackson police all right so uh, so obviously the other thing that I can tell you here is the uh, the handlebar position is very very comfortable I mean just everything about this bike is just ergonomics it's got cruise control obviously and uh, it's very windy here and let me tell you it's just it's just breaking through the wind like nothing look at this oh man that's that is just so nimble guys wow just absolutely absolutely nimble man look at this it just you just lean into this thing holy smokes that's amazing it really is the way it just dives right into the curb like that wow very very nice it's got the hill assist right here that's freaking awesome I just love those bikes super well balanced I mean look I've got only great things to say about this this is only a first impressions video my goodness complete comfort complete wind coverage you know just super plush suspension acceleration obviously is already there even though we didn't test it this is the same engine as mine this thing is fast as heck beautiful display and just the handling man I mean, look at this, just boom, dives right in there. I had to cut that video short because the GoPro had some issues, as usual. But uh, let me tell you, man, that bike, super, super nimble. If I had to give you the top feature on it, it would be how nimble it really feels. That front tire at 17 inch, the guys were talking about it, man. They're absolutely right. It makes a it makes a huge, huge difference. Even compared to this. And this bike is one of the most nimble bikes I've ridden. But that thing is super agile. Congrats, brother. Thanks for letting me ride it again. Enjoy it. Alright, we're gonna go. We're gonna go to a nice spot and we're gonna try some authentic we're gonna try some authentic Cuban coffee or like we call it cafecito or cafe con leche and we're taking it with us so uh, right after you ride that uh, RT and then you get back on this one when you take the corners that bike is just way more nimble it just is it's got to be the size of the tire and the position of the handlebars. I mean, it's got to be everything, obviously. And let me tell you, this bike is freaking super agile, super sporty. But uh, that that bike just feels awesome, man. So like I was sharing, um, I'm taking you to this new spot. It's in Asbury Park Beach. And if you're in the area around here and you want authentic, legit Cuban food, 
you got to come check out this place. It's called Latin Diner. It's loud, man. Nice. It's a real horn. No. No, it's like a car. Look at that thing, man. That's beautiful. He's got to get this upgraded stereo system. <laughs> By the way, that's about the only thing that's not good on that bike. The speakers that that thing comes with are weak at best. <laughs> so this uh, Latin diner uh, opened up about three months ago. I think it was maybe three months, maybe a little bit more. And uh, every day they have a uh, preset menu of different traditional Cuban dishes. And by the way, I happen to know that the chef is Cuban. Like, born in Cuba, came here, and he is uh, the real deal. I've had the food there a bunch of times, and uh, it is just really, really good Cuban food. If you're down in this area, Central Jersey, South Jersey, or Asbury Park, do yourselves a favor, go to Latin Diner. You will not be disappointed. Highly, highly recommended. It is fly and ride approved. Go check it out. Tell them fly and ride sent you. From first to second, the, yeah. the, the tune takes it away. So what uh, CD was talking about there, he's saying that the um, the quick shifter is too snappy from first to second, and that is very, very common in these boxer engines and these BMW bikes. And what I was telling him is, once you do the BT Moto tune, it takes it away. Not completely, but it certainly lessens it. All right, so this is the place I was telling you about. Check it out. It's called Latin Diner. It's got some tables out here. It's got a walk-up section there. And then I'm gonna take you inside now and show you all the way around. But look how cool this place is. Authentic Cuban food, Asbury Park. And there's a city supermarket there if you wanna get your groceries while you're at it. Come check them out. Fly and ride approved. Let's get some good food. All right, check this out, look at that. Steve, what do you think? How's that, how's that naturally, freshly squeezed orange juice? Enjoy. Thank you. Stop, guys, look at this. Awesome, awesome place. Make sure you come check them out. Latin Diner. All right, let's give this a try. Look at that. 13 years, every day with them. Wow, amazing. So this is uh, Deal, New Jersey. Look at these houses. Ocean's right there. Look at that. Look at this view. Whew. Man, look at this. How awesome is this? See how nice the sand is here? Yeah, because nobody's here. Nobody's, no, here. nobody's here. Exactly, yeah. It doesn't look like you're in New Jersey beaches, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Look at uh, Nadal's future boat over there. What is the name of this town? Deal. D-E-A-L. So this is the kind of content we bring you here on the Fly Ride channel. It's all about the BMWs. Check out these. Check out the lineup. All right, so look. We're going to wrap it up right here. Hopefully you enjoyed that amazing, amazing Cuban breakfast. Latin Diner, make sure you go check them out. Beautiful views, amazing destinations, amazing bikes. That's what it's all about here in the Fly and Ride channel. Do me a favor, hit that subscribe button, hit that like button, hit that bell notification so you can be reminded of future content. Thanks for watching.